So I want to give you some head up, you know, ahead of the week. Okay, and this is the reason why this video is being is being made. Uh yeah, you know that this guy is in prison, um CZ, the former CEO of Binance, is currently serving his prison term. Now, many people expected that this guy should have been out of prison since last few weeks from now, probably last month, but he's still not out of the prison. And you'll be asking, why is this guy not out of the prison yet? It's probably because he, he didn't get into the prison at the right time. You know, when they give you a, a, a prison sentence or a jail sentence of, let me say, three months, you're supposed to use 90 days. But if you delay by three weeks, then if you delay that sentence by three weeks, like you didn't get into the prison at the right time, then they will have to increase increase the jail time. Like not really increase it. If you let's say you're supposed to get in like January first, you got in around February first, definitely you are not gonna be out of that prison by you know January, February, March. You know, that person will be out of the prison by May. Sorry, by by April. So if you Spend extra three weeks outside of the prison before you enter. So you sp you spray you spend extra three weeks kind of. So that is how this guys you know increase the time we be leaving the prison. All right. So till September 29th. Now here is the important thing for you. Uh, this is cryptocurrency and anything is possible in crypto. It is possible that when, once this guy is out of prison, then we may have a good price movement on BNB. Not as if he's the one who is holding BNB down. No, I'm not saying that. All right. What I'm saying in a sense is that we may experience another top on BNB. Okay. Probably it could get around 750. There could be a mad pump. Like, you get it. There could be a lot of euphoria, a lot of enthusiasm on, on BNB, and this guy could top around 550. Now, for those of you who have been in the crypto niche community for a while, Okay, you are quite aware that the average entry price for us is on the BNB is 150 per BNB. All right, and we are still holding pretty much tight to what we have. So at 750, you should not feel bad about taking profit at 750. All right, so take some profit when you get there. That is why I have to make this video and share this information with you. All right, so at 750 per BNB, can you set your your TP right there if you want. Okay. You can just like um liquidate part of your holdings, maybe like about 50% of it or 40% of it, and hold the rest for the moon as the moon bag. Exactly to you now. So because once Sizzlet is released out of prison, then that quickly triggers some pump on BNB because um CZ in, on the, by himself is a movement, you know, is an individual. And is capable of moving the market or shaking up the market, you know, especially things that has to do with BNB, BSC Smart Chain, Binance Exchange, you know, and everything that revolves around that ecosystem. Is that clear to you now? So prepare your mind, don't be don't be uninformed. Okay, don't be unaware, don't be caught on unaware. So at 750, we are definitely going to be offloading part of this pack right there. Is that clear to you now? So moving on from there, um, because if you look at the crypto market in general, you are having um, a level of fear, you know, has actually reduced. Okay, the fear has reduced to like, you know, from twenty two to like thirty eight. So it shows that a couple of you know the, you know people are becoming more confident in crypto once again. Exactly now. So I'm gonna say say this. This is not. If you feel that this guy is is probably over. Over overbought at this at this junction, then you may be wrong about it, okay? Because there's still a lot of room for growth, you know, as far as all of these coins are concerned. So all you need to do basically is to just select uh, based on knowledge. Don't do it. Uh, don't do it with ignorance, okay? Yeah, that's I'm gonna say that. Otherwise, you get punched, you know, real fast. So go to the market and do some hardcore fundamentals on some of these projects. That is if you are not already adding some odds to your bags. Okay, do some fundamentals, you know, from the side and see which one will make sense for you. you know, pick them and, and see how far you can go with some of these um, cryptocurrencies. So, moving to Bitcoin, you discover that for the last few months now, you know, all the way from March, it's been 
you know, th this is a very critical support level for Bitcoin, okay, and it is holding really, really firm, okay. It is holding really, really firm, and it, this support has been tested like a few times, like one, two, three, you know, times, and we had a, a, a resistance also here, okay, one, two, three, been tested like how many times now? About, about three or four times on this resistance level, okay, and that is and, and that puts us on a ranging market since March this year. Okay. So when people are saying that oh Bitcoin is crashing, you know we're in a downtrend, no, this is a clear is a clearer picture. Okay, this is a clearer picture for someone who has been in the game for a while. Okay, so what you see here is that we are not in any way, you know, look at this, 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 this Okay, this is a typical movement in the ranging market. Okay, all right. So it is ranging around this price, around seventy-two thousand and fifty thousand. So for those of you who have background in trading, you must have been able to take a good advantage of this. You know, and for those of you who are in the crypto community, we discovered that we've been able to take a lot of advantage of this price action. All right. No, a couple of times now we bought around fifty two thousand, fifty thousand there about. No, I waited for the moment to, to occur and we actually made some cold gains on that trade, on those trades. So it is obviously so what we are as long as these levels are not violated yet. I mean this support level is not violated yet, and this um this resistance, resistance level is not aggressively violated yet. Okay, it still maintains that pattern. Okay, that structure is still pretty much there for Bitcoin. So when you see Bitcoin around 70,000, 71,000, you shouldn't just be too excited, really, okay, because it's still pretty much moving around the previous resistance points. So for you to rejoice on anything, there has to be a complete breakout of this. Okay, around seventy seven, eighty thousand dollars per BTC. So you can say, oh wow, we are pretty much in the BM in, in the bull market. Okay, so this is the ranging market, and this is this shows that this guy has truly matured over time. You know, this shows a lot of maturity. Okay, unlike some of your favorite altcoins that are down, down, down so bad. You know, so it puts a lot of confidence, you know, um, into the minds of investors. It puts a lot of confidence into the minds of traders. Okay, so it makes a lot of sense. And this kind of market is quite easy to to, to trade. Exactly, you know. So that is the update. So. I don't see Bitcoin breaking out of this, uh, breaking, you know, violating the structure, or probably uh, breaking out of this pattern in the next few weeks from now. Even not even in this month. Okay, it's still probably going to be ranging here. So probably October can actually make can be a big deal. You know, as usual, October is kind of October. <laughs> so you can have an upward movement in October that will really take us, you know, far in this space. Otherwise, if that if that not happen. October, November, then we have to continue with this range, this um, range, right? You know, for for you know, for same um, future. Does that make sense to you right now? So, um, again, don't forget to subscribe to the channel. This is the Kutoni channel. Okay, um, be part of those who are enjoying the insightful, insightful content on this channel. Okay, subscribe, turn up the turn up the notification bell, invite your friends and your loved ones to also be a part of this channel. Okay, that is how. We can keep growing together, and also, and, and also have a good thing for you. Um, maybe, maybe next week or this week, I want to be doing a lot of teachings, you know, for free on YouTube. You know, making videos that will educate you, that will get you pretty much, in, you know, informed about this ecosystem, this market, okay, the financial market. Because obviously, if you're not informed, then you're gonna be deformed. Okay, there is no middle, there is no middle ground. Okay, there is no middle ground. Either you're informed or you're you are, or you are, you are deformed. So you want to be deformed, you want to be more informed as soon as possible because that is where the money is in this space. So don't forget to subscribe to the channel, you know, like the videos, share with your friends, and uh, give some thumbs up, you know, make a comment down below if you have any questions to ask about this analysis, you know, as you are preparing for it for next week. Just go ahead and let me know. Okay, I'll be glad to respond to your questions in the comment box because I reply to comments as fast as possible because I'm always online. Okay. You can't be a trader if you're not always online at all times. All right, so um, that is it. And for those of you who have been asking a lot of questions about the Jakarta trading algorithm, um, I've already posted about it in the, in the Telegram channel. 
okay it is right there check it out um and lastly if you've not been part of the crypto niche community on whatsapp we're talking about the, the crypto niche channel on whatsapp and also on telegram you are missing out a lot okay so just go ahead don't waste don't waste time okay just go ahead and click the link in the comment box or probably in the description okay uh i'll, I'll probably pin the the link to the groups to the channels okay right there in the comment box click that link so they can join the community all right so that is it pretty much this weekend so bye and have a great day